My name's Tom Beauchamp, I'm 52 years old. I'm a husband and a father of six, children ages 16 through 25. I've let my health go over time, bad eating habits, not working out properly, letting stress get to me. After multiple visits with the doctor, trying different eating habits, diets, uh, exercising on my own, it got to the point where I have to be medicated. And my doctor said, if you want to live to see your kids and your grandkids, you have to do this. It just was a realization that I do have to do something to take care of myself or I'm not going to be there. And uh, I have a lot to live for and, uh, and I want to live a good quality life. Between um, an intern that I had for three years that was working out here at Mecca, uh, he was a college athlete and he'd come in and tell stories about how he was getting his butt kicked and how much he improved his uh, 40 time, his bench and all his strength. And you know, you're intrigued by that, but again, I'm a 52 year old guy that is not a college athlete. And you know, I was at the point where I had to do something. I knew I had to start taking care of myself. Not that I'm neglecting every, every other aspect of my life, but I'm carving out time. You know, you know, it's a dose of reality. It's kind of hard to hear. You think uh, all the choices that you made to this point that got you here, you know, when you're young, you're invincible, nothing affects you. And uh, as you get older, you get smarter and wiser and you realize that that wasn't the case, but it, at that time it's too late. And I, and I do think what I'm doing right now is gonna make me stronger, feel healthier. I, I want to do healthy things right now. I want to eat right, I want to get sleep. I want to learn how to deal with stress. I mean, I'm on a path of going the direction I need to be going right now. I'm getting stronger and I, I see potential that I didn't see well, nine months ago. So your goals are changing. I, I still have the goal to be healthy, but now the goal might be to do 10 pull-ups where I couldn't do one or two when I came here, which I never thought I would ever have that as a goal. But it is, you know, you're more in tune with your body and what you're able to do. One of the things I never thought of is that pain would go away. I have ruptured discs in my lumbar that I, I lost like an inch in height and it's just bone on bone, in it. but to be able to not have pain, can't even put a price tag on that too. Just talking about it right now has made me think of things that I, I had come accustomed to just live with, and it's nice to not have that. It changes your outlook on life. When you're in pain, you're less patient. You're not yourself, I guess, and I'm feeling more like myself and able to be control things a little bit easier. Don't let yourself get to the point that I've got and take care of yourself, whatever it may be. This works for me to have somebody push you, to have somebody that even if they're not pushing you, you're pushing yourself because you don't want to let them down. It is a very positive atmosphere. There's no you know, shaming, whatever. You come here and everybody wants the best for you. There's a lot of just people that are doing the same thing that you're doing. I, I owe a lot to Mecca in getting to where I'm at right now. I'm excited to go in for my next blood work and see where I'm at and uh, look forward to doing this as long as I can.